and welcome back to Akita's Creations. Today we are making a turmeric and sea moss face wash. So I want you guys to kind of see the consistency here. I don't know if you can, but um, I'll try to show you at the end of the video the consistency. But let's go ahead and get started. So the things that you're going to need today, and I did try to pre-measure a lot of it because um, just for the sake of time, you know, obviously I like to make the videos a little bit quicker. So that's why I do it the way that I do. So what you're going to need to begin with is 150 grams of distilled water, which is what I have here. I'm going to move my scale over. And... Um, we're gonna thicken this water. And the way that we're gonna thicken it is, we're gonna take our xanthan gum mixture, which in this container, I have um, about, let me see, cause I have it all uh, measured out. So I have about uh, four grams of turmeric and one gram of xanthan gum. And to this turmeric and xanthan gum mixture, I'm going to add uh, about five grams of glycerin. Okay. So, and excuse my daughter in the background. So I'm gonna add about five grams of glycerin. So I have my scale ready and it's on zero. So now we just have to measure out about five grams of glycerin into this container. So that's 1.8. So that's five on a head. So now what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna take a spoon and I'm just gonna combine this together. And as I mentioned in another video, um, xanthan gum clumps up really easy and so does the turmeric to be honest. So the best way to get it to, um, blend more like uniform is to make a slurry of the uh, powder with the glycerin so that xanthan gum mixed with the glycerin um, makes the uh, mixture not uh, clump up so I'm gonna move the scale over now what we're gonna do is this I'm gonna take our 150 grams of water and I'm gonna add our thickener to it, this xanthan gum and turmeric mixture to our uh, water. So I'm just trying to make sure that this is completely uh, combined before I add it to the water. So now what you wanna do is you just wanna add your uh, mixture into the water to let it thicken. And you wanna try to stir it as quickly as you can because it has a tendency to thicken uh, pretty quickly. I'm gonna add the remaining. Um, now I'm gonna put you guys on pause for a minute while I continue mixing this because I know it's a little loud. So just give me one moment, please. All right, so now that we have that combined, you can see how thick this mixture has already gotten just from that one gram of xanthan gum. And um, I did add in the turmeric, as I mentioned, to our water. So this is now uh, 150 grams of water, um, one gram of xanthan gum, five grams of glycerin, and about four grams of turmeric all combined in this um, beaker and you can like i said you can see how thick the consistency is already so this is what you want it to look like all right now what we're going to do next is we're going to combine um also well let me just start with this i didn't show you guys i have in this container are uh, sea moss and our aloe vera gel. So Ooh. I have about um, 15 grams of sea moss in here and I have about 14 grams of aloe vera gel. So I'm gonna add both of these into this 
bigger container and then I'll transfer it back out um, once it's all mixed because um, this one will be easier just for me to mix it up in. So for now, I'm just gonna transfer it all into this one and I'm gonna mix it so I'll be right back. Okay, so at this point, I have combined um, most of our ingredients together in this container. There's still like a slight uh, clump or two in here that wasn't um, completely uh, combined and that's fine. You can just kind of press them up against the side of the container to smooth them out. And uh, so you can kind of see what it looks like. The mixture here. All right, so at this point, we're gonna go ahead and add in our surfactants to the mixture. Now the surfactants that I'm using is, um, I'm going to show you. So I'm going to use about 50 grams of this uh, cocomidopropyl betaine as well as um, 20 grams of this uh, glucoside. I've already combined the two together. They're both pretty liquid as you can see to start. But once you combine them together, you get a really thick uh, mixture. So I'm just going to go ahead and add this now to our um, water combination and I'm gonna mix this together and I will be right back okay so now I have everything combined as you can see I want you to see the consistency of this it's uh, nice and thick and as I said before if there are any little um, residual like bits in there from that xanthan gum which tends to happen so imagine if you didn't add um, the xanthan mixture to that glycerin there would be a whole lot more in here but um, you can continue to smooth those out but um, for the most part this is the consistency of the mixture once everything is added and another thing I'm gonna recommend um, adding to this is um, you want to add about um, a gram of essential oil of your choice. I'm using lemon and orange uh, because of the color that um, the turmeric gives it. And some liquid Germal Plus, which is, um, you know, a milder uh, preservative. And you definitely want to preserve any product that has water in it. And um, that is pretty much it. So... You know, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this recipe. Um, if so, go ahead and uh, like and subscribe to the channel so that uh, we can continue putting out um, more content. Um, I'll see you guys on the next video.